With Israeli forces poised to assault Gaza Strip's last city and international efforts building for a ceasefire, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan made it clear during a recent visit to Cairo that he wants a pivotal post-war role. We will continue our cooperation and solidarity with our Egyptian brothers for the bloodshed in Gaza to stop. In the medium term, we are ready to work with Egypt for Gaza to recover and be rebuilt. Turkey has a large construction industry, skilled at working overseas in challenging environments. But analysts say Ankara could be eyeing a role beyond reconstruction. The Turkish government has already made it very clear that they'd be very interested in the, in the reconstruction of Gaza. Whether it will be only left to them is a different question, depending on who does the financing. But there may also be need there may also be a need for um, a peacekeeping force. I mean, you need to provide security. And there, maybe Turkey can play a role because it does have first the expert, I mean, the expertise on it. Erdogan is a staunch supporter of Hamas, describing it as a liberation movement, while calling Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu a terrorist. That, analysts say, will make cooperation between the two leaders difficult, if not impossible. However, they say Erdogan may be banking on a changing political landscape as opposition grows in Israel against Netanyahu's coalition government. He reads the future like uh, Netanyahu will be out of the picture uh, one way or the other, but Hamas will be staying. So uh, I will be on the right side uh, when Hamas stays and there will be negotiations with uh, Hamas. But the magnitude of Hamas's October attack on Israel and Erdogan's long history of support for Hamas leads some analysts to warn that damage to Turkey's relations with Israel extends beyond the animosity between the Turkish and Israeli leaders, given Ankara has hosted senior members of Hamas over recent years. There's a lot of suspicions in Israel against Turkey, uh, both because of its reaction to the war, but also because we know of all this Hamas activity that was going on in Turkish soil. I think, again, you can never say never, but on the face of it, it would be very hard for Israel to accept Turkish involvement in the post-Gaza mechanism. With Qatar and Egypt leading efforts to end the war, analysts say Erdogan is eyeing the potential post-war situation to reassert himself as a critical player. But they say that would require elimination of Israeli distrust. Dorian Jones.